Hey guys, and welcome back to the channel. I appreciate you guys showing up. Wanted to show you uh, another one of my previous builds. This is the uh, Kenworth Big Rig Hauler, is what I call it. Can't really remember what kit I started with. <laughs> Excuse me. It's just uh, another one of those custom builds. I don't build a lot of... Uh, the the tractor trailer series model kits this is actually one of two that i've ever built and i don't own the first one it was the actual uh wrecker but it was years ago back when i was a teenager and this one happens to be carrying the Lindbergh 32 ford hot rod pickup they just ended up being the same color it wasn't one built for the other it just happened but let me tell you a little bit about the truck since I've got to remove it anyways. It's just basically out of the kit. Not a whole lot of detail to it. Uh, straight, basically out of the box with some of the details that came with the kit. I just didn't add to it. Just a little hot rod, but a pretty cool kit. I mean, it's it's got some cool features to it. Love the big moon discs and white walls. They always uh, go well with the old hot rod to me now the rig however and sorry i can't spin this thing around it just takes up a lot of space this thing's been stretched lowered de-chromed and uh, accented with black a few little features here and there and truthfully i can't remember all the details i've done to this truck uh, i'll try to recognize them as i go but the uh the engine is a little detailed, nothing nothing major, not a lot of wires or anything like that, but it, it is painted up, cleaned up. I didn't do any of the uh, trim work in, in chrome. I, I was trying to keep it more of a euro color uh, than putting a bunch of uh, chrome on it. Get you around there to see it. The windows have visors on them that scratch built those and then just basically uh painted the uh upper portion of the glass here just to black it out same thing with the vent windows the uh bed is scratch built never actually finished the bed sorry about the shaky phone never actually finished the bed never put any tail lights on it or handles for the uh, opening panels Let me get the uh, bed off and show you the underside of it. What I did was, like I said, I stretched it, zed the frame so I didn't have to alter the suspension. It's pretty much out of the box the way it comes, just some little details here and there. But I figured I would build something a little different. At one time, I did have the... Um, the, the connecting rear fenders were, they were both front and rear fenders here for the rear wheel assembly were connected together. I know you guys have seen that, especially if you build the, uh, the big rig model kits, you've probably used those. I'm not sure where I put those. They're somewhere in another box, in another galaxy. But either way, I wanted to show you guys this one. Sorry, I can't spin it around, but unfortunately, it takes up a lot of space. But I wanted to show you guys a little hauler I built. One of those kits that uh, I didn't do a lot of details to. Just had fun building it. Hope you guys like this one. If you have any questions about it, how I lowered it, I'm sure, is going to be the... Uh, question on the front the uh, fronts just basically um, altered the spring assembly can't really show you that because it's too big to pick up and uh, get to the detail but I just basically lowered the front suspension by cutting plastic here and there or removing what I needed to and adding where I where I had to and that's about it it's more or less for for show and like I said, lowering the back of it was just, as you saw, 
zing the frame and stretching it out was just adding more of the um, styrene plastic. I added the panels here to reinforce the frame where I zed it and uh, stretched it. But yeah, what what I thought you guys might like to see uh, through uh, the other kits that I do have that I'm planning on showing, I thought this one would be a good one today. So, I won't keep this any longer. If you guys like what you see, uh, please continue to like subscribe share you know hit that like button leave a comment i try to read all my comments and leave a comment in return you guys have a great day be safe and uh, keep building thanks guys see you next time